Amen. Bless the name of the Lord. Today I'm going to come from Isaiah, the 58th chapter, and the 6th verse. It says, It's not this the fast that I have chosen, to loose the bands of wickedness, hallelujah, to undo the heavy burdens, and to let the oppressed go free, and that ye break every yoke. That ye break every yoke. You know, um, for this morning, I woke up and I was just praying because the Lord had showed me, praise God, hallelujah, had given me a vision. And he showed me it was, it was like, it was like a building and it was different people in there of, of different denominations, different ages, praise God. And it was like this house had segments and it had sections, praise God, hallelujah. And there was those that was in the house that was looking for peace. And it's like they were just running and running and running and running and running, just going here and there trying to find peace, praise God, hallelujah, glory be to God. And as far as you can see, amen, was just air, it was just space that they could just go to infinity, praise God, looking for peace. And then as I looked, it's like the Lord said, look to your right. And as I looked to the right, I seen the word yoke. I seen the word yoke written on it. And he says, these are, this is the area where the people are dwelling that are yoked up, praise God. And I was just praying and saying, God, what are you saying? And he gave me Isaiah, the 58th chapter, praise God, in the sixth verse, praise God. And it says, is, is not this the fast, praise God, that I have chosen to loose the bands of wickedness to undo the heavy burdens and to let the press go free and that ye break every yoke praise god and the lord is saying this morning praise god glory be to god is that some of you have tried everything to get free praise god but he's saying in order for you to get free you 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 have to fast amen he says some things only come by fasting and praying praying by itself it's not getting it done hallelujah you're gonna have to set aside your Praise God, your dainties. You're going to have to set aside your plate. You're going to have to deny yourselves of some of the things that the flesh like, praise God, to break, hallelujah, that wickedness, amen, off your life, to give you that peace that you want, amen. But what stood out is the yoke. When someone is yoked up, you know, when you take something and you yoke it up, you put something around their neck and you yoke it, hallelujah, that it can be steered and go whichever direction that you choose, it's praise God. And the Lord was just ministering to me and he was saying, Glory be to God. So many, praise God, hallelujah, are out there, praise God, that are yoked up. So many people are yoked up, hallelujah. They're yoked up, praise God. They can't get free, praise God, of that, that habit, praise God, that, that habit have them yoked up. Amen. Glory be to God. Hallelujah. Glory be to God. And then he started telling me, you know, and, and some people are yoked up because they're under the influence of someone else. They're under control of someone else. They have allowed somebody to come in their life and yoke them up. Glory be to God. And they have yoked them and bound them up. Praise God. Hallelujah. They cause them to be depressed all the time. It caused them to be oppressed all the time. Hallelujah. Glory be to God. You know, a yoke is if you got someone that's abusive, that are abusing you, they can be abusing you mentally. They can be abusing you physically. Praise God. They can even be abusing you with the words of their mouth and they continue to yoke you up, continue to put you in bondage, continue to put you in that place. But God said, hallelujah, call a fast. Amen. And begin to fast for your situation and begin to fast. Hallelujah. That those yokes, hallelujah. And those, those bounds, hallelujah. That depression, hallelujah. And that wickedness that's around you, that the high, oh, yeah, hey, hallelujah, that got you bound be removed. And then the Lord also told me, he said, and let them know, praise God, that you don't want to be the yoker, praise God. You don't want to be the one that's yoking people up, praise God. You don't want to be the one that's causing that woman and that man to fall into the spirit of fornication or adultery. You don't want to be the one that's yoking up, hallelujah, someone's mind, praise God, yoking up, hallelujah, someone's freedom, someone's joy, someone's peace, praise God. Don't be that stumbling block. Hallelujah. God saying, if you are are yoker, praise God, or if you are yoked up, you need to declare a fast over your life, over your situation. Pray and go before the Lord that he will remove it from among you. I love you and may heaven forever smile upon you is my prayer. Glory be to God.